Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm OP and in today's episode we'll be going over some of the best highlights from the matchup between Weibo Gaming and BLG during the semifinals of Worlds 2023. Without further ado, let's dive straight into the action. So sure, they may get a little bit of a less preferential base, but Shun gets to steal the camp for free and he could look for his ear. Oh. In with a nice little knockback into the shy, but unfortunately, he just have flashed a lot of on his ear left yeah. to work with. Now, hold on, Xiao, who in some trouble here gets stunned up. Yagao following up with the damage, and now the chase gets paid its first blood over to Yagao. Meanwhile, back in the bottom lane, the 2v2 breaks out. On's in some trouble. So much damage pours in, and light pierces his heart. Nicely done. They got that kill on the bot side on On. But I was watching on the minimap, I saw the Q flash come through from Shun. I have to think that Xiao flashed into the wall. Just yep. based on, on where, what actually happened with those flashes and the way that we saw them run out, it's possibly just flash. Power of the Maokai ulti, if they want to set up one of these dives, if they want to go for one of these plays, Maokai also being a champion who has an aggro drop in his twisted advance to further facilitate those dives, and here they go. On throws out the binding, but it's not going to be enough just yet. Elk uses the cleanse, but he's not the target just yet. On having a flash, but he still dies. Elk's going to be hunted down, and Light gets a double kill. Weibo are running the bottom lane. That is huge for Weibo. But the Shy needs to try and hold on to this top side. Down towards bot. The Shy has TP. He can just come right back up. They are going to drop the Heralds because they're just in desperation mode. Caitlyn's down 1,000 gold. They know they need to start knocking down towers. They need to get out of that 2v2. But this took a lot for them to get. And the Callista farmed so many plays down on bot side. And that's the thing because you've now got Light who's in such a good position after getting those. Game from Zayas where he went super crazy in the late game. If you get in towards Shojin, you get in towards those super high CDR builds. You can actually hit the point where you're getting two shot class per acceleration gate, and that's where Jace, I think, kind of becomes actually a strong late game champion. Mm -hmm. uh, but of course, you still then have to be getting that past all those frontliners. Okay, nicely done from Bin. He waited for the Bellows breath so the Shy would not be able to immune the ulti, but now he's looking to keep this going. He goes unstoppable again. Flashback over the wall from the Shy. Q3 comes out from Bin. He doesn't have enough damage just quite yet, but the Cassante takes him down. It's a solo kill for Bin. It's a dash bash dash bash but Bane is able to come out on top and now with that struggle they're coming in for mid lane as well they go for the Maokai ulti they find Shun here in the front as they follow it up with a hostile takeover oh it's gonna be the first kill and Weibo are looking for more they chase after the Sejuani who does not have his arctic armor or the Af Bin TPs into the middle the Shy's not gonna find his engage here yet hostile takeover hits the Cassante and meanwhile the Orn Horn flies over the top binding almost finds life but not quite yet the Shy's here tanking up in the front but he's gonna die Elk gets the kill and the shuffle tries to buy a little bit more time Chris is gonna be shot through the head as on kites light away a double kill back over to elk and now it's blg crushing weibo yagao with an accelerated shot blast and he'll cut down the tree xiao hu at least takes bim and he might get a second the emperor of sharima will die before the third as elk takes light out of the picture and blg get the ace the gold right where you need it right back into live right back into a fight maokai ulti flies out and shuns under a lot of pressure the damage flies into the sejuani and he dies as hostile takeover finds it out he shuffled back into weibo massive shutdown over the light weibo just found everything how the hell did they find them at all there weibo come back in they play around the choke and they're onto the baron Baron started up, 5v3, Bin, Elk, Wei and Wei's On low. have to try to pull off the defense. The Shy down to 10% HP, Weiwei's gonna be taken low too. Bin stoning the rest out as the Shy will finally fall. Kalista with a ton of spears into the Baron as Elk is under pressure from Chao Hu. Bin is all out, but he's only one man. He goes back in and he finds a kill, but it's still Baron over to Weibo. It's still Bin about to go back over to Weibo. It's Weibo all day. Weibo get the Baron, they get the kills. On, searching, not gonna have enough damage to knock them down. They're gonna TP in, they wanna try to keep the way. Who was denied that opportunity alongside a light to get to the world champions for a while. Shun wants to go in on the shy. He lands the 20 ulti with the Bellows breath, manages to get through it. They fire off their own counter attack on Weibo's side, and Ben's looking like a pin cushion. He disengages but barely stays alive. Crisp now nearly killed. Shun also at death's door. BLG will hold on, but they are critically low. Weibo still looking for an opportunity to re engage. Only Crisp is really threatened here. Xiao Hu taking a lot of poke. Now has to eat the ace in the hole as well. Chris could not tank that for him, as it's now a TP is coming in. 
Weibo still trying to get themselves out. Ben wants something. He sees Weiwei Wei behind him, pushes him back. Wants to go for the all out, but he won't knock him through the terrain. Ben still in hot pursuit, trying to find a knock up, trying to find a knockback. Won't find a damn thing. BLG hold the line. They hold the line with this Weiwei Wei not really in They're this position started. before. Shun hasn't been in this position before. And now it might come down to the a Shai smite fight. They're bottom. rushing it. The Shai is bottom. There's no teleport available for the Orn. And Maokai still has no ulti. Weiwei's the target. They gotta try to keep him away. The Kasante focusing the enemy jungler. Going all out to take him all the way to the other side of the jungle. Bin will likely die for this. But they get the Baron on the side of BLG. Weibo get one kill back. But what else can they find? Really gutsy call there from BLG. The Shy makes a critical mistake. He shows bot. They just commit to it instantly, TP4. They started up because the Shy had no gold here by BLG. But they did use quite a bit to get that damage down. Nice chunk. That trap placement was perfect there from Elk. And Weiwei is so low. All right, Weibo still facing down a difficult situation. Weiwei on low health. Chris still at about half. Some ulti still spent. Light does not have Kalista ulti ready to use here in this fight. Weiwei is going to get jumped on. Bin goes in. He's all out. He takes the enemy jungler away back over the wall, but he escapes into the sun disc. The Lux ulti comes up the top, and Bin is unstoppable. But what about the fight back in the Drake pit? The handshake onto Shun, who flashes away to stay alive. The dragon is over. Is secured. It's stolen away. Kalista of Light manages to steal the soul as Yagao wants to turn around, but he can't do it. Light gives him up in his R2. It's a double kill back over the Kalista. As Shao Hu kills Ben, it is so many dead on BLG. It's Light who secures it, but it's G needs to make the miracle hold. It's 15 seconds on Shun. It's Caitlyn Lux against everything. The minions are still coming. The Shy taking a little bit of damage here. They're going to be stunned up. No damage enough just yet. Finally, the Shy's going to drop on an elk. Still holding on. A little bit more damage from the Luxy. Handshake back and out, but he ain't gonna die just yet. Shun comes in, but he will not find the ulti connection. The They're still getting away. Shao Hu, the ace in the hole comes through, but Chris does a good job blocking it. Shun still chasing. Light is down. Chris and Shao Hu running BTP. away. He's TP's coming. coming in. Yagao wants some. Accelerated shock blast doesn't hit, but Chris is slow. Renata doesn't get away from these. Bailout's not gonna bail anything just yet. And Yagao with a counter punch. BLG have the performance to get us into this position. Weibo and BLG. We gotta go back to live. Yeah, yeah we, we, we gotta get back to live here. The chase obviously goes on a little bit longer. We know Yagao comes in and kills Crisp. The dance in the mid lane continues as the coaches have to be on their edge of their seats for either side. Or Orange Summon. Light Binding's not gonna block anybody. Instead, they're just gonna collapse it on his dead. Hostile takeover locks down Shun. It's two kills back over to Weibo. BLG is on the run. That's it. And Weibo is on the victory march. They're going to push here. They're going to go for it. Weibo have the Nexus in their sights. The super team needed to come alive. And send to hold him off here. Ben with a handshake back into the team. He's not going to live through this one. Xiao Hu throws out their soldiers. And Yagao loses Guardian Angel. Ben trying to find a little bit of damage onto the shy, but it ain't going to be enough as Elf tries to go forward with a 90 caliber net. But it doesn't matter. It won't do a damn thing. Weibo, through all the doubt, through all the disbelief, will earn their place in the finals. The haters are silenced as Weibo finds the victory. These were some of the best highlights from the world's 2023 semifinals matchup between Weibo and BLG. Which moment was your favorite? Let me know in the comment section below. This is OP, and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care.